Hey, it's Corey from Amplified Afternoons here to flash back to River Riot 2012. This one holds a special place in my heart for uh, quite a few different reasons, actually. One, it was my very first year here at the river. In fact, I'd only been here for about a month and they threw me on this giant concert at Mid-America Motorplex. Remember that, when that happened for a little while? So, you know, I'd grown up listening to radio stations that threw these massive concerts, and here I am excited to finally be in the River family, one of the only radio stations left in town doing these massive concerts. And I get down there, and I'm told that I'm going to interview Shinedown. Now, I was a little bit nervous about this. Now, on the bill, by the way, was uh, Incubus was your headliner, you had Shine Down, and you had Five Finger Death Punch. But I was a little nervous about inter interviewing Shine Down because I'd interviewed Brent Smith from Shine Down two years before that. And let's just say it was a little bit difficult. Now, anybody who knows anything about Shine Down and Brent Smith and what he's gone through over the years, you know that he's made some changes, some positive changes in his life. And when I interviewed him originally back in like 2009, 2010, he, he was going through his hard times. He was going through his struggling times, which I didn't really know that at the time, but it was a difficult interview. But then in 2012, when I interviewed him, and it wasn't just me, it was myself and Spicoli, when we interviewed him uh, at River Riot at Mid American Motorplex, it was like he was a completely different person. Brent Smith was like positive and he was happy. It was easy to talk to. He was having a good time. So, you know, he overcame his struggles and uh, he turned into a completely different person. So. This goes to show that everybody's human. But one thing I loved about that lineup too is it was such a great representation on stage as to what the river is all about. You know, here on one end, we had the hard rock, the metal, of Five Finger Death Punch. And on the other end, you had the alternative music of Incubus. In fact, I remember Brandon Boyd of Incubus after the show saying, I definitely know that we've never played a show with Five Finger Death Punch before. And he's like, that's really cool. I don't know if it'll ever happen again. So. Just a perfect example on stage as to what the river's been doing for many years on the radio and that's sort of melding together the worlds of alternative and hard rock. So that was River Riot 2012.